Hey guys, it's Kara, and I suppose I should explain where I've been. Alright, so it's one part my fault, and one part my school's fault, and one part laziness, which I suppose would also be my fault. So, okay, let's say two-thirds my fault. Alright, first reason it's my fault, I kind of broke my editing software. Don't ask me how I did it, I'm not even sure myself, but I made it so I could never see any of the videos that I was trying to edit. Which is a bit of a problem if you can't guess. Uh, finally got off my lazy bum and fixed it, that was a laziness, I didn't feel like downloading it. And until I felt like re-downloading it, there really wasn't any way to edit the stuff, and unless you guys want to watch two minute clips, it just really wasn't worth uploading anything. The one part my school's fault would be the fact that again <laughs> by kicking my butt um statistics actually is not as hard as i thought it would be calculus is not as hard as i thought it would be economics is way harder than i thought it would be i don't know why i do not get these concepts i can do math i can plug in math problems but if you ask me to do critical thinking when it comes to economics my mind just goes blank so, what prompted me to do this is that someone subscribed and said, make more videos, and I'm always happy to please, even if it's just, you know, three people that are watching my channel, because the, if I could ever get back on track, then I would obviously attract more people, because they'd be like, oh, she updates on a regular basis, not, oh, she updates about ten videos and then goes away for two months. So, I'm going to try as hard as is physically possible to update more often. That being said, does anybody have any suggestions? I mean, I'll do, I'll keep doing what I want. I have no problem with that. I mean, this is obviously not Terraria. It's Jamestown. Watch the video. I know that doesn't might not seem interesting to some people, but it is a really fun game, and it's really worth looking at. Um, but if anyone has any suggestions, I mean, I have so many of different ideas. I could go through my games library and just pick some of the games that I love. I could go through my games library and pick some of the things I haven't played, because I have a games library about 60, because I keep buying the Humble Bundles. So a lot of the games that I have, I haven't played. And I would not mind playing it for, playing them for you guys, just if anyone was interested. I mean, if people want more Terraria content, there's options there too. Should I do more by myself? Should I try to do challenges? Should I invite more people? I mean, you guys saw part one, and I'll probably update more of that once I figure out where those files went. But I do have friends who like playing. There's uh, Andre, there's Joe, there's Jeremy, there's Brendan, and there's Tavin. So any of those people I could get along to play with me, or all of those people. And we could do challenges, we could do custom maps, we could do just hardcore PvP, we could try to get ourselves into a Capture the Gem series, you know, try to see if we could play against Ice Syndicate or Odyssey Games or something. If anyone has any ideas or comments please let me know and as i think that's about it let's get on with the video that i actually recorded in the beginning of february i think it was so i think i'm a little late but anyway enjoy all right guys so hello it's kara and um the reason i haven't been making videos much lately <laughs> is because school has been to put it in slightly vulgar terms kicking my ass I have calculus and statistics and economics. And the funny thing about that is, I'm not in a business course. But apparently, to be an IT tech at the business course I want to work with, or to be an IT tech, I have to learn business as prereqs. So, in the meantime, my friends and I have been talking about making one channel for all of us. The problem is, none of us can come up with a name for it. My theory is because no one's really trying that hard, but I'll keep bugging them and thinking myself, and hopefully I'll come up with something. In the meantime, I took all my games on Steam, counted them up, put them in a number generator, came up with number 27, which is Jamestown, which happens to be one of my favorite games. So. Without further ado, let's start. I'll start with chapter one. I'll do it on difficult and probably get my butt kicked. This is not an easy game. It's a dual stick shooter. I'm actually going to use 
my controller, as you can see by the little you know, controller icon over there. So, A to fire, X for my special, and B to Vaunt. Where Vaunt is, you'll see soon. This is not a hard game to understand. Basically, the idea behind it is the colonists that came over to America to settle Jamestown, but in space. Let's go. I already know all this, but I'll let it play so you understand a little bit about what's going on. those of you that don't know, Roanoke was one of the first settlements in America that just mysteriously disappeared. Master Chief, wall. I'm not an Xbox nerd. Now, I recorded a video before this, I won't explain which one, but I had to scrap it because you cannot hear me talk. So I've turned this volume down as much as I can. I can't bring myself to mute it because the music in this is just so good. But I turned it down as much as I could and hopefully... It'll be enough. Okay, remember how to play, Cassie. Thank you. Okay, so this is my special attack. This is my normal attack, which on this ship is honestly pretty useless. You gather these coins, and as you can see, there's a bar in the upper left, along with my health. Incidentally, this is a you die like twice and then you're gone kind of game. All right, now here's the box. You do this shield you from incoming projectiles and then as long as you can keep that bar above zero by collecting more coins you can keep up your vault which gets you extra points like that boom his attack, which is easy to dodge. Oh, I still get points from it, so it's best to collect it anyway. See how the projectiles are getting blocked? And if you get in a bad way, like say I got caught by the, those shots, I could do that to end my vaunt early and give myself another little temporary shield. Which means I basically wasted my vaunt, but I should at least show you guys what's going on, right? Die, evil Martian creatures. Oh, carp. Carp, 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 carp. Ah, vaunt! Lots of extra points. Try to get all the stars. Yeah. Yeah. Die. It's a bad time to still be vaunting. Not our 
earning points, and I can't defend myself against this guy. Oh, hey, okay, cool achievement progress. Yeah, I have no bonds. All right, build up bonds by killing these things over here. Whoa, Nelly! Die, 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 bonds! Die, 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 die. Dodge. Gift. Pretend I have the tiniest sense of hand-eye coordination. Destroy everything again. Yeah. Aha. Oh shit, Vaughn. God, he did that. And those things hone. Homing beacons are not fun. And wow, I'm doing amazingly. I guess the trick for me doing amazingly is to talk to myself. Da. <laughs> die, please, die, please. Thank you. Ah, only have four stars. Four. Ah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, ha, ha. thirteen thousand away. Oh, Hulk could be known as the perfect player. I'm okay with that. Nah. Okay.